So you've been lying to me? All this time. All this fucking time. And Seneca's been telling me that we were going to be doing Sled Storm. And instead, we're doing this piece of shit. Welcome to Razor Freestyle Scooter, Fuck everyone. <laughs> you <laughs> it's a short game i promise oh my god i promise i only had what to i beat it in 30 minutes uh what? i really? beat yeah it's a short ass game there's three levels <laughs> <laughs> wow uh, okay yeah we could totally do this razor freestyle scooter is a playstation game uh released because kids fucking love scootering i i know i did i owned a scooter i owned a scooter too i really did i owned a motorized scooter and i took that motor and I turned it into a golf ball cannon. It was pretty cool. Anyway, man, Razor Freestyle Scooter. This is like the one game I didn't have to rebuy. Like, let me just tell you. Oh. Let me just tell you. Um, you know, when I was a kid, had the PS2, had a bunch of games. Pretty much all the games that I played for this series I, I owned. And, you know, but then I got an Xbox, uh, realized Halo was amazing, uh, put away the PS2, and... Sometime during there, uh, I lo like all my PS2 games disappeared, except for Razor Freestyle Scooter. And I think, I think my sister told me like uh, a couple months ago when I asked where they all went. She said that my cousins uh, must have gotten a PS2. Uh, I guess around the time that I that I stopped playing mine, and maybe maybe they were like, "Hey, can we borrow some of the games?" and Maybe I was even like, yeah, sure. I don't know. I God forbid you share. I'm so offended still. That so they took every game but Razor Freestyle Scooter. I guess just from looking at the packaging, they realized it was complete shit. You motherfucker. I promise we'll do Sled Storm after this. I just, I really wanted to surprise you. You motherfucker. And so, how is this game? Just it's just it's a like it's a shitty cash grab. Um, it has probably the bare minimum amount of effort put into it. It looks like it, yeah. But coming off of Dave Mira, I can say that having like so little effort put into it, it actually makes things a lot like m more fluid and easier. Like if you go to do a spin, your guy will pretty much always like finish off looking at the ground or looking straight up like he'll pretty much always land the spin on his own and if you like launch off of a quarter pipe but you're not going to land anywhere your guy will automatically like move around so he'll land on the ground like on his scooters uh, well on his wheels like you have to actively try to crash to crash and so it's easy to play i mean there's not a whole lot you can do but it's easy to play so, a giant robot stole your friends, but you're allowed to play as any of them. No, no, no. You only have two at the start. It looked like you had, like, five. You had, no, you had Chad, uh, this cool-ass dude, and you had Amy, that cool-ass girl. I guess I'm, I guess I'm used to not having as many friends as these kids, I guess. I mean, S scootering brings people together, man. Like... You should have known that. Like, every day, I'd go with my friends to the scooter park. There was a scooter park around us? Well, it was kind of like the skateboard park, and so then... is there a way to fuck this up? Like, is there a way to go down? Y yeah. Because it looks like even times when you normally fall, you don't, you're not falling. I mean, obviously, I played the game uh, a little before doing this. Like, I made sure I could get through all the levels, because... In every level, there's six goals. You know, one like beat this score, and then one that's beat this higher score, and one where you need to grind a certain amount, and one where you need to get like X amount of extra time. Like, the one kind of different thing this game does is you can see the bar on the right that goes up when I do tricks. If I do enough tricks, um, session, well, just enough tricks without crashing. Uh, the bar fills up and I get 10 more seconds added on to the amount of time I have in the level. Like, I can start with two, but then you can just keep getting extra time. Huh. Then another generic co collect all the wheels that are around uh, uh, challenge. Uh... <gasps> so you got all of them, some of them. 
Oh yeah, and then a combo challenge. Which is actually kind of hard, because combos in this game kind of suck. 30 wheels? Yeah. Uh, how big is this level? I kind of stayed in the main area. Uh, other things about the game, the soundtrack is about five songs. Good. Good. Are they name brand songs? Or are they like royaltyfreemusic.com? Oh, uh, they're, they're name brand, but I like never heard of any of the artists. And they're all... And they're all basically like if you took, I don't know, like Sum 41 or, or Blink-182 Blink and you made them even more child-friendly. Oh. Like if Radio Disney became like pop punk. Yeah, I can see that. St uh, music to listen to while you ride around the scooter park before you break for a, for a, a high C uh, carton. Or a complete sun. Well, actually, I was watching Stephen Colbert earlier today, and apparently Campbell's new thing is Campbell's Go, and it's supposed to be for young-ish people. Those are their words. Like, that's their advertising people. It's for young, and then in parentheses, ish, people. Yeah, Campbell's has been trying some weird things lately. Like, you go to a grocery store, and in the soup aisle there will be Campbell's, there's Campbell's Chunky, well, that's been around for a while, but then there's, like, Campbell's Bisques, and, like, Campbell's restaurant-style shit, and it's like, no, this is still, like, cheap-ass soup. It probably tastes crap, but it comes in, like, a fancy container that's basically like those, like, boxed milk containers. Hey, Campbell's is fucking amazing, and so is boxed milk. All right. Bag milk is worse. Campbell's is actually pretty good. Their uh, chicken and corn chowder oh. is very good. Yeah, fucking delicious. We live off of Campbell's and uh, and totally, noodles. We should totally like do like a an LP of a can of soup. I don't know how it would work. Six, wow. So you're gonna break stuff and like a oh, biscuit and. We're so cool. I wish a limp Wow. Oh my God. There is a way to get taken out. Oh, wow. So that thing's just the bane of you. Why do you have a cast on? Because uh, it was cool to have casts. It was cool to sustain injuries but keep going. Yeah. I know the feeling. Fall and you get back up again because you're that rad of uh, a 10 year old. The guy hit me with his car at Best Buy today. Uh, so this is the fourth time you've been hit by a car? No fifth. It was three back when we so did. Dave hit me with his car three times, but uh, I, uh, I've been hit once before that, and, well, actually not before that. Dave was still the first person to hit me with their car. Dave's his brother, by the way. Yeah, yeah, and uh, he he's, wow, you're like 12 points away, and you're just, okay. Why yeah. You end the run. Because uh, that was a 6,000 point combo. Oh. Yeah, I, I gotta say. I know that my uh, my gameplay of this level isn't as good as it could have been, but I'm sorry, I'm not willing to become a Razor Freestyle Scooter Master. Y you know, like, I can believe that. With, with, kind of, with this whole LP series, I'm just gonna say right now, and this is gonna go somewhere, that kind of the reason I started all of these, like, extreme sports games videos is because... I don't know, just like, you know, a couple years back, I'd remember a game I played for the PS2, like Jet X20 or Dave Mira 2, and I'd look for videos, you know, I'd look to see, if, like, gameplay videos or maybe even an LP of them, and there'd be, like, none at all, and even if there were videos, they'd be really, utter like, shit. Utter, utter shit, like, 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 fuck up every single aspect of, like, uh, of doing it like they'd film their tv with their camera they'd zoom in so much you could only see like the middle part of the screen and then they just like they try to be funny the entire time yeah they i'm like us if they talked if they talked like on like honestly i've seen like dave mirror too i'm not gonna call out the guy but there's uh another playthrough of dave mirror too which is like 50 videos long. <laughs> that guy. <laughs> and all of them are 15 minutes long. And like, 
basically he's filming his he's filming his TV. He's zoomed the camera in so much you can barely see anything. Like you would be lost if you were coming to his videos for guidance. And when he does talk, like he just complains about issues that are completely like irrelevant to the game. You know, who, like who thinks Bill Cosby's funny? Like yeah, like in one video, like it's silenced for five minutes and then just Man, why the fuck does everyone think Bill Cosby so funny? Like, <laughs> <laughs> you know, now this could be a game if you if you really want to find out who that is. Huh? Huh? Nah, nah. Please do not go uh, flooding uh, his videos with like negative comments or anything. <laughs> um, uh, but so what I was getting at was, so so the purpose of these LPs is to either make an LP for a game I liked but that there are like no videos of like Jet X 2 where I tripled the amount of videos that are on the internet with that or to make an actually good LP so that if anyone else just like thinks of these games you know like ah, I played those as a kid let me see if I can remember them they get you know edited you know on point videos and usually that's been pretty easy. Like, I haven't had to beat out any competition at all. Well, didn't Laharl do some videos that you were, uh... Oh yeah, Aggressive Inline, I did have to go to another guy's videos. However, he also filmed his TV and and was barely on topic and would just go like, Oh my god, whenever he fell over. But, okay, what I'm trying to get at is, Razor Freestyle Scooter, there's actually a guy who's pretty damn good and he did an LP of this. Of this game. Filmed hit, uh, no, no, uh, used a capture card, and, uh, was pretty damn good. Now, he did do live comms, so there's some stumbling, but, uh, Psychocodix, um, he completes these levels about three times as fast as I possibly could. Like, he gets everything in one run, like, on all three levels. Really? Yeah. Huh. So, you're doing, this is strictly just to fuck with me. And the people in the thread. Oh, so they didn't know either. No, they didn't know. Good. Excellent. So wait, are we gonna are you gonna get through this entire game in one video? Uh, it, it'll take two. Damn! Well, they're it'll, it's only a half hour. It's like a half hour of hell, basically. But <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at those polygons, man. I was thinking we could get back to the good old days, like. Like downhill domination, I noticed that the key to success is that I'm not trying to explain every single part of the game to you at all times. You know, we could just like, you know, we could just go with the flow. You know, we could become brothers. I thought we were already brothers. We could become even more brothers. We could become blood brothers. Cut from the same cloth. Blood brothers. Sure, let's do it. Okay, I'm not really sure how we would go about it. Uh, I left my I left my knives back in. Uh, no, no, that's not what I meant. I meant like literally, like genetically related. That's gonna take some thinking. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to put the mic down while I while we think this through. What do you think? I think yeah. Um, I don't know. We could. Uh, I think. I think. I th maybe we could get like skin grafts of each other. I'm not sure that would work. Or you know what? How about this? How about this? I'll have my skin removed. You have your all right, skin. All right. Removed. Yeah, that sounds good. I will switch. We'll switch skins. <laughs> sounds uh, great. We're gonna Aside from the fact where you're like like a foot shorter than me. Right. And 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 your dick is like four or five times as long as mine. So yeah. Yeah, that sounds good as well. <sighs> so we're gonna have to do a lot of stretching. Mhm. Mm but I think we could do it. Mhm. Mm I think. Yeah. I mean, totally. Mhm. Mm okay. Cool. Yeah. All right, guys. Uh, we, we decided what we're yeah, gonna we've, do. Yeah, we figured out a plan. Uh, you probably don't need to hear the, the yeah, gory no. details. So, uh, so uh, we there are three levels. Wait, well, wait. Did he try it on the top of? Well, three levels, and then. So you'll notice there are six objectives for each level, sure. and they're like the same six for each level. Sure. If you complete. All three of the same type of challenge mm -hmm. from each levels, you unlock like a secret level. And so there's six secret levels. And if you beat the secret levels, you unlock one of the characters uh, that oh. you were hanging out with and the robot stole from you. Oh, so there are nine levels in this game. But 
six of them are really small and oh. three of them are basically the same things just with extra harder elements so that was the first two levels uh you know, the video is running to 15 minutes. That seems like an okay length to break things in half. That was Razor Freestyle Scooter Part 1.